in this video, we're going to show you that the raspberry boom actually responds to changes in atmospheric pressure. And so to begin, what we're going to do is just open and close this door, which will change the pressure inside the room, and you'll see that on the signal. Door is handle with a little bit of force. We'll just do three or four there. All right, so you should see the changes in atmospheric pressure uh, inside the room on the data. And the next thing we'll do is we'll take the raspberry boom and we'll demonstrate that it responds to changes in barometric pressure. And the way we'll do that is we'll just take the raspberry boom off the stand here, we'll lower it about a meter to the floor, uh, we'll give it a few minutes to, for the signal to come back to, to zero, and then we'll lift it back up again. Okay, so you'll see the signal coming back down to to the zero line, and you should have seen a big change in barometric pressure, which should co uh, be about 10 pascals. Okay. And we'll bring the unit back up to the stand here. That's it. And so you can see now that at home, you'll be able to see changes in barometric pressure that come from uh, Natural phenomena such as volcanic eruptions, if they're close by, tornadoes, uh, incoming storms, explosions, and planes that break the sound barrier, as well as doors and windows opening inside the home.